Johnny Depp, 59, is reportedly set to stay at the forefront of Dior Sauvage as he signed a new three-year deal with the brand, according to reports. The Pirates of the Caribbean star is said to have just landed the largest men's fragrance deal in history for upwards of $20 million. It was also claimed Depp was paid nearly twice what Robert Pattinson earned as a spokesperson for Dior Homme, according to the Variety report. Other Hollywood A-listers who are said to be getting paid less by fragrance brands include Brad Pitt, who was paid $7 million to promote Chanel No. 5, and Chris Pine, whose deal with Armani is valued at $4 million a year over three years. The reports come after Depp called his defamation trial against his ex-wife Amber Heard a horror show as he began to navigate life after his win. Back in November 2022, Depp expressed his gratitude in the past to social media content creator Andy Signore for using his platform to support a Hollywood actor during the defamation trial. Signore, who runs a YouTube channel Popcorn Planet, uploaded an exclusive interview at the time with the actor backstage at one of his gigs. Backstage in Las Vegas, Depp could be seen giving Signore a massive hug before the fan exclaimed, Oh my god, thank you. I have been through a similar thing and am just so proud of you. You didn't give up, it's going to make me emotional. You seem so happy now, I'm so happy for you. I'm just happy I could use my platform to tell people the truth. Don't miss. Holly Willoughby blindsided and upset by Philip Schofield's statement on feud, insight, miserable Ben Affleck slams car door behind Jennifer Lopez after coffee date, latest, May Muller rushes to cover up wardrobe mishap and gown on live Eurovision show, update, Depp replied, you guys are the warriors. It stunned me that all of you got together and lifted me above the horror show. I can only say thank you from the very recesses of my being, for everything. For all your support, thank you. In June 2022, after a lengthy hearing at the Fairfax County District Court, the jury found that Heard did defame the Pirates of the Caribbean actor in a 2018 op-ed for the Washington Post. After the unanimous verdict, Depp was awarded $15 million, 13 million pounds, in total, broken down as $10 million, 8 pounds, 3 meters, in compensatory damages and $5 million, 4 million pounds, in punitive damages. Meanwhile, Heard was awarded $2 million, 1 pound, 7 meters, in compensatory damages, with this being the verdict the actor wants to overturn.